Hi guys, this is me and my 206-6241 just doing uh, my alternative methods of catching catfish like at night when I'm not at the river just, you know, trot lines and stuff, jug lines, limb lines and then I'll show you my snagging rigs but start off with the trot lines usually I'll make these out of plywood but I bought this one last night just to try it out I bought it at Walmart, it's like three bucks, four bucks and then this is the twisted twine um, I think it's rated at two, 235 pounds or something like that I don't, you know it's just a for the main line not the droppers for the droppers I use 80 pound mono um, this is a dropper uh, see if I can do this real quick show you how I that's not gonna work we'll see if I can show you here I'll take it. Got me a swivel here. That's a 200 pound swivel. I'll make a loop and a line. Put it through. It's 80 pound mono. It's kind of hard to bend. Put it through and just make a simple little loop. Pull it tight. Just like that. And that's a lot longer than I normally use. Usually I use about half that. That is a 9 knot Cat Max hook from Bass Pro. It's like, I don't know, 7 bucks for like 50 of them. You know, pretty cheap. That's how the trot line I use everything from Shad or whatever's working. That's not the pole I normally use for snagging, but it's a heavy enough one I can put this weight on. Two five ounce bank sinkers, ten ounce snap, ten ounce treble hook, and I have it tied so it's all in line, not dangling. I usually use this line, Mason Big Cat line, 72 pound test, uh, about 13 bucks for 150 yards, and then just ten ounce. Bass Pro snagging hooks, ten bucks for you know five of them or twenty five of them, but yeah, that's just what I use for trying and snagging.